Richard Dean Anderson is a versatile and accomplished actor, best known for his iconic television roles. His career has spanned decades, and he's left an unforgettable mark on popular culture. While he's celebrated for his portrayal of Angus MacGyver in MacGyver and Colonel Jack O'Neill in Stargate SG-1, his journey through the world of entertainment is a testament to his talent and dedication. Join Facts First as we present, at 74 years old, Richard Dean Anderson reveals why he quit acting. Early Life Richard Dean Anderson was born January 23, 1950, in Minneapolis. He grew up in a family with a mix of Scandinavian and Irish heritage. His parents were Stuart J. Anderson, a teacher, and Jocelyn Ray Carter, an artist. During his youth, he showed an early interest in sports, particularly hockey and track and field. He even dreamed of becoming a professional hockey player. He attended Roseville Area High School in Roseville, Minnesota, where he excelled in sports as a member of the hockey team. But a series of knee injuries ultimately derailed his dreams of a career in professional sports. He briefly attended St. Cloud State University, but later transferred to Ohio University in Athens. At Ohio, he pursued a degree in drama and began to develop a passion for acting. This shift in focus marked the start of his journey into entertainment. He moved to New York City after college to try his luck as an actor. He began working in theater productions and made his way into television in the late 70s with guest roles in series like Seven Brides for Seven Brothers and The Love Boat. But his breakthrough came in 1985 when he was cast as Angus MacGyver in the hit series MacGyver. The show's immense popularity catapulted him to stardom and made him a household name. Career Highlights Anderson's portrayal of the resourceful and inventive secret agent MacGyver made him a household name, and the character of MacGyver became synonymous with using intelligence and creativity to solve problems. Another significant highlight from his career was his role as Colonel Jack O'Neill in Stargate SG-1, which ran for 10 seasons from 1997 to 2007. His character in the Stargate franchise was charismatic and complex, and the show garnered a dedicated fan base. Anderson's portrayal of O'Neill further solidified his reputation as a versatile actor capable of handling both action and drama. He also has made guest appearances in various other TV series and movies, showcasing his range as an actor. His career highlights also include his involvement in humanitarian and charitable endeavors, like his support for organizations like Waterkeeper Alliance. Personal Life Richard Dean Anderson is known to be relatively private when it comes to his personal life, tends to keep details about his relationships and family out of the public eye. He's been in several relationships, but one of his most well-known was with April Prose. The two were romantically involved for several years and have a daughter together named Wiley Quinn Anna Rose Anderson, born in 1998. Leaving General Hospital Richard Dean Anderson left the popular soap opera General Hospital in the early 1980s after portraying the character of Dr. Jeff Weber for several seasons. His departure from the show can be attributed to a combination of factors. By the time he joined the cast of General Hospital, he had already started to gain recognition as an actor. But his role on the soap opera significantly raised his profile and he became a well-known figure in the world of daytime television. In 1982, after playing Dr. Jeff Weber for several years, Richard decided to leave General Hospital to pursue other acting opportunities. This decision to depart was likely influenced by his desire to take on different kinds of roles and expand his acting career beyond the constraints of a daytime drama. His departure from General Hospital marked a turning point in his career, leading to his iconic role as Angus MacGyver, which catapulted him to even greater fame. His decision to leave the successful soap ultimately proved a wise one as it opened doors to a broader range of acting opportunities and allowed him to establish himself as a beloved actor in the industry. Leaving Stargate His departure from the TV series Stargate SG-1 was primarily due to personal reasons and a desire to spend more time with his family. He played Jack O'Neill and was a central figure to the show's success. His decision to leave had a significant impact on the show's direction. Anderson had been a part of Stargate SG-1 from its inception in 1997 and continued as a lead character throughout the first eight seasons. But by the end of the eighth season, Anderson expressed his desire to step back from the series to devote more time to his family and personal life. The demanding shooting schedule, often involving long periods away from home, was taking a toll on him. 
To accommodate his desire for a reduced schedule, the show's producers and writers came up with a storyline that saw his character being promoted and given a desk job at Stargate Command, which allowed Anderson to appear in a more limited capacity. The storyline allowed him to spend less time on set and more time with his family. His reduced role in Stargate SG-1 allowed the series to continue and new characters were introduced to fill the gap by his departure. While he may not have been a regular presence on the show in its later seasons, his character remained a beloved part of the Stargate universe. Recent Years and Retirement Richard has been noticeably absent from television in recent years. His decision to step away from a full-time acting career is attributed to a combination of factors. Firstly, Anderson retired from acting after his time on Stargate SG-1. The demands of his role as Major General Jack O'Neill had become taxing, both physically and mentally, leading to a sense of burnout. The relentless shooting schedule and the pressure to deliver high-quality performances contributed to his decision to pursue a quieter life. He had become a father at age 48 and wanted to focus on raising his daughter. This life-changing event marked a shift in his priorities, leading him to adopt a more homebound lifestyle and enjoy a quieter existence on a farm. His commitment to fatherhood and his desire for a more balanced life contributed significantly to his reduced presence in the acting world. His thoughts on MacGyver Richard has spoken fondly about his iconic role as Angus MacGyver. His portrayal of MacGyver, a resourceful secret agent known for using everyday objects to solve complex problems, left an enduring impact on both the actor and viewers. He often expressed gratitude for the chance to play MacGyver, recognizing that the character had a unique appeal. He appreciated the character's intelligence, problem-solving abilities, and pacifist nature, which set MacGyver apart from typical action heroes. He once stated MacGyver was a character he truly respected and admired. Through interviews and conventions, Anderson has shared insights into his time on the show. He talked about the physical demands of the role, which often involved performing stunts and action sequences, as well as the challenges of maintaining MacGyver's persona as a non-violent hero. As for the legacy of the show, he acknowledged its enduring popularity and the show's continued cultural impact. Now it's time to hear from you. Do you miss seeing Richard Dean Anderson on TV? Let us know in the comments section below.